We've got a probable location of Mohikoyo's Buchon. The house is located in Rancho Sabala. If our guy's there, grab him and bring him in. the rebels to do a recon of the area. Watch out, place is rigged with an alarm. Enforcements won't be flying in. Gah. Got it, moving. Let me get a good sight line. Target quote. Standing by. No target. Oh, here Repeat. we go. They've no seen target. us. Opening fire. Get ready. Fire. Roger that. If you're looking for the biggest house in town, I think we found it. Let's say hello. No se mueva. Ponga las manos donde pueda verlas. We're looking for the guy running Mojo Coyo. We know he lives here. Antonio? I don't know where he is. Bullshit. You're his wife. Yes, but he doesn't tell me anything. He barely comes home anymore. Antonio, he's... he's sick. Sick how? Chiquito loco. He took the women from the village. All of them. I don't know what he's doing to them. Where is he now? If I tell you, what are you going to do? Nothing bad. Swear. We just want to get him the help he needs. He never stays anywhere long. Always moving. But I'll give you his agenda. Man down, yo, man down. on the supply, Lieutenant? His name's Antonio. Seems to have a bit of a coke problem. His problem is he has too much of it. But let him know we'll help him out with that. You can tell him yourself when we bring him in. Bowman sent the file on Antonio. Every week, more than six tons of white powder moves through Mojokoyo. It's a transit point, where shipments are kept secure, awaiting export to Brazil, the U.S., and Europe. 
Antonio is the Buchon out here, the boss. His job is to keep all that coke safe. Thing is, being surrounded by cocaine all day is a really stressful job, like being the fat kid in charge of the sugar factory. And we all know what happens when you eat too much sugar. Your brain rots, you stop talking on phones, you stop trusting your own people, you stop going home to your wife. You even stop telling anyone when the shipments are coming in, until the moment they arrive. When it comes to coke transports, Antonio is a vault. And I want to crack that motherfucker open. Hang on, I'll drive. Clear out. I'll meet you there. Here's our boy. The lieutenant's trying to escape. Sniper's got us targeted. I just requested a rebel recon of this area. I called the rebels for reinforcements. Family, motherfucker. Chingao. Ya, ya pues, ya pues. Ya estuvo bueno, ya estuvo bueno. Ya, ya, ya está. Ya, ya me entrego. Puta, ya, ya no dispares. No, no dispares. Ya me entrego. Me entrego, me entrego, me entrego, ya estuvo. ¿Quién fue? Who snitched on me? What pinche soplón pocos huevos gave me up? I went to the shaman. He put me on a vision quest and I saw the future. Yes, of course. A huevo pendejo. Right back at you. Even if you find the polvo, don't mean you can get it. I got me plebe all over those shipments, ready to give their lives for it. That's good, because I'm ready to take their lives for it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah,
space. Me entrego, me entrego, me entrego, ya estuvo, ya. Chicao, ya, ya fue, ya fue, ya estuvo bueno, ya estuvo bueno. Got an SB antenna over there. Turn it off and we knock out the cartel's comms. Family, motherfucker. Ya, ya, ya está. Ya, me, ya me entrego. Ah. Antonio, it's such a pleasure. <laughs> Vete a la verga, bitch. Stop flirting, you little slut. The fuck is this? Christmas. You didn't hear the news? News about what? Your death. Apparently, you OD'd. You want me to... I want to see your brain on drugs, pendejo. One way or another. Did I tell you to stop? going. She said keep going. I... I can't. My heart feels like it's gonna explode. Please. That's the point. Now clean your plate. Please. You want Nidia Flores, right? She's in Jalisco. Jalisco, Mexico. Santa Blanca is investing in meth. I don't know how long she's there, really. The first step to recovery is admitting you have a problem. And you, my friend, have got a big fucking problem. Nomad, just finished TQ on Antonio. What'd he give us? Besides a whole lot of bitch tears? Everything. Main stash and transit depots. Every motherfucking gram in the province. Guessing there might be some management changes in Santa Blanca. You wanna light up Antonio's stashes, feel free. But if you wanna look for nicer weather, you can leave the burning to somebody else. That coke's not going anywhere. Roger that. If we hang around, we'll send you some smoke signals. Here's a lesson in cocaineonomics. The biggest mistake most people make is focusing solely on the product. Claro, you need something to sell, but that's not where you make the money. One kilo of coca leaves costs about $1.50. It takes 400 kilos of coca leaves to make one kilo of cocaine. Even when turned into cocaine base, a kilo is only worth 1200 in Bolivia. However, every time you cross a border, 
the value increases. Once we reach Colombia, it's already 2,200. We hit southern Mexico, 12,000. Cross the border into Texas, 20,000. New York City, our $1,200 investment is now worth 35,000. Paris, London, 68 to 74,000. It's a pipeline that carries the product to the people that need it. Sustenance for the thirsty. Once in place, the pipeline feeds itself. Workers, vehicles, wages, bribes. But when there's a clog in the pipe... Uh, they took out another shipment. We lost seven tons last week. Four planes the week before? The water backs up. There's too much surplus. We can't keep it secure. My men are selling to each other. We can't pay people if they're not moving product. They're kidnapping civilians for ransom money. Too much water. We have to take Valeria and go. He'll kill us before we leave the country. Then what's the answer? When I find it, I'll let you know. And you drown.